is going on everybody welcome back to the channel man it's mods gaming this is your boy mods and today man what we're gonna be doing is uh we'll be trying to get planes or aircraft with the uh, gift card of friends doing this with regular cars isn't so bad guys but aircraft makes this glitch a lot trickier and what i'm gonna be doing is uh, i'm doing you know i got two consoles here you can do this with a trust i mean a friend whatever be a trusted friend but I'm gonna try to get this uh, sick ass chameleon orange shade camo cooler here. And uh, for my other account, what do you have to do to start off is basically, um, and this, you know, this is kind of the same with regular cars too, but obviously it's trickier with aircraft, but you have to block off both sides, I found out. So uh, both characters can teleport in and out. You see, I got the, I've got the, uh, the pilot side uh, blocked off over there, and here a little bit later, I'm gonna be blocking off this side here with my, uh, the giver's MOC cab. And what it's going to do is I'm going to put the uh, cab access to no one. That way, the receiver, this character here, doesn't accidentally get inside the MOC. He just teleports inside. And it's crucial. And you'll see why later. So, okay. I got my MOC. Very important. Call your MOC out and put it in the spot first. Because um, there is actually a solo method for this to get glitched out using the terabyte. But you cannot uh, call your MOC out after uh, you get your terabyte or go inside your terabyte garage to glitch out. And, uh... Obviously, uh, you, you know, you have to go inside your terabyte so, uh, to, to, you know, to get glitched out. So, uh, this is really, doing the solo glitch out is only good for facility gift card friends or to to merge with, uh, to go finish the glitch off down at the arena. So, uh, the method I'm doing using two consoles, uh, it's a little different because your MLC will not despawn. I'm using this glitch over here, excuse me, this job over here to, uh, to get glitched out. And uh, basically what's going to happen here is I'm going to get an invite. Uh, from my second uh, console here okay and I can show you the footage later but they're gonna send the invite they're inside their terabyte inside the nightclub and then they're just gonna stand by the door hovering over the exit okay uh, so I'm gonna get this invite I got it and what you're gonna do is you're gonna hit X and spam right in the d-pad real quick after um, and like I said, this is a little easier if you got somebody helping you because they can see when the all the all exit thing pops up. It's going to pop up on their top left of their screen on their menu there, and they're going to hit all exit. Okay. And then they're going to tell you when they spawn outside their terabyte, you're going to be in the job. Then you're going to back out of the job at that point. Obviously, I have to switch back and forth, so it's a little trickier for me. But you know, either way, so that's how it's going to go. So we're going to accept this, spam right on the D-pad. And then I'm going to wait on my second console here to the all exit thing comes up. There it is. Okay. I just accepted it. I'm going to wait till that character spawns outside the terabyte. Like I said, okay, they're outside the terabyte. We're going to uh, back out as soon as the job loads in here. And, you know, one of three things can happen. Okay. I can back out of the job here and I'm not on the radar for whatever reason. No big deal. We just start over again. Wait for where we're at. Uh, okay, let's see how I got my, my mini map there. You can't see the streets. That means it worked. I did actually uh, glitch out hit the first time. So that's cool. So that's the second thing that could happen. Obviously, that's what you want. Third thing is, and this is the worst possible scenario, you get teleported to their terabyte uh, for whatever reason. And you're obviously your MOC is going to despawn. You got to call it out again and blah, blah, blah. Uh, so, okay. Basically, uh, I'm going to request my uh, vehicle from the MLC, my personal vehicle, my LG, uh, LG RJ, excuse me. Uh, it's gonna spawn, the game thinks I'm in the, uh, you know, my console 2's uh, nightclub, so it's gonna spawn, see it right there. Uh, and most of the work actually has to be done by the giver here, unfortunately, this is one of them glitches. Uh, so what's gonna happen here is I'm gonna go outside, and I could show the footage on the console too for you guys, but it's really, I mean, it's really necessary. Uh, I'm just going to walk you through it here. Uh, okay, so what it is, they're going to take uh, the receiver's personal vehicle and they're going to drive it down. And I'll fast forward the video or, or cut to when they actually get down here. I'm not going to make you guys sit here and watch me just stand here like a, like a goofball or whatever. So we'll pick it back up when they get down here. All right, guys. So we're back. Uh, got this, all this crap set up. Uh, my second console's got his MLC over there. 
Mine's right here, personal vehicles right here, ready to go. Little pro tip guys, I got my second uh, character up there. Uh, the reason for doing that is so the MLC won't, uh, we found out a while back, the MLC won't, you know, flip out and go completely ape shit and come over here and, you know, land on the frickin' Akula and destroy it because the Akula's got paper mache like armor on it. Uh, we got the MLC, which is absolutely not fun trying to get that in here. I can tell you that right now. Uh, you're better off getting the, um, this is the Phantom. Get the hauler cab if you have it because it's smaller. It's a hell of a lot easier probably to get in here. Um, so, okay. We got that all set up, basically. Um, make sure I can teleport in here and out. Yep, okay, we're good there. Got that. I checked with my other, uh, my other uh, account, too, as well. They're both teleporting because you got to be... One got teleported in while the other one started... The other one's tele teleporting out, excuse me. I mean, a really difficult freaking time talking today for whatever the fuck reason, but... Uh, anyway... So, okay, and hopefully this all goes well. Sometimes you get sucked in the MOC here, and if you do, guys, you gotta start all over again. And it really sucks. <laughs> not gonna sugarcoat, not gonna hold you. So, let's get inside the uh, the elegy here. What I try to do is, first of all, turn these stupid lights off. I try to, uh, I try to get to where you just barely get the option, see? No fucking way. Right here. Like, back up a little bit, options gone, move forward, options there. Sometimes you might have to kill this a-hole over here, too, but he's behaving himself right now. And he's got, like, freaking Merriweather kill you from a thousand yards with a pistol aim, so keep on the lookout for him. But I got the MLC parked. I like to keep the circle right just to the left of where the, um, the drainage ditch thing there meets. That's my little sweet spot where I like to do. Okay, so, uh, yeah, hopefully everything works well here. Let's hit right in the deep end, see what happens. Okay, cool, it's flipping out. That's what we wanted to see. It's flipping out on my screen, uh, but on your friend or console 2 screen, it's not going to be doing anything. And that standing up there just prevents that from happening. Just, you know what I mean? Just make life a little easier, guys, right? Nothing wrong with that. So we're going to take console 2 over here. We are going to... Uh, go over to the MOC, inside the back of the MOC. Uh, on this one, what we're gonna do is, uh, we're gonna get out, and wait a minute, and then uh, you can get out. Either way, it doesn't matter. If this car is on the map, so it'll get deleted. Um, but okay, so to get rid of this funky-ass camera here, we're gonna do is go to jobs, play jobs, Rockstar created missions, tighten a job, no big deal. Uh, it'll make the MOC disappear, but that's irrelevant. Because we've, you know, that memo he's already done this job at this point. Obviously, we're going to back out of this as soon as we load into it. Quit. That'll give us our little handy dating camera back. See all that disappear. There's the dupe demo C. What we're going to do is we're going to finish out the, uh, finish out the glitching out process here. I'm going to, uh, invite, uh, with my second account, I'm going to invite my first account. Uh, to the MLC. What I'm gonna have to do, guys, I'm just gonna have to go grab the Akula again and sit in it. That, that's, you know, that kind of sucks. You know, you know what I mean? But it is what it is. I'm, try to, I'm gonna have to try to maneuver here with the MLC, block it off and all that good stuff, which sucks. But what are you gonna do, right? And the Akula is especially difficult because you can't put it against a wall because it's got the helicopter blades. They'll break and then it'll disable the vehicle and blah, 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 blah. blah. It's just like I said, you gotta really want these aircrafts, guys. This, this is kind of uh, not fun at all. I'll be honest with you. This is not fun. Okay, so, alright, I got the uh, MOC invite, same thing just like glitching out from the terabyte. We're gonna accept it and spam right in the D-pad real quick. Spam the hell out of that. Should get sucked into the job like so. Okay, and then we're just gonna back out and pretty much just wait right here. We're, we're ready, as soon as we get in the vehicle, if it doesn't freaking disappear, it's going to uh, suck us in. But we're just gonna stay right here in this state, right here, just like this. No big deal, nothing about that time limit or anything like that. We're gonna take uh, console number two here. Nice, I know you can't see it, but I can't control, I can't, you know, do two counts at once recording, so. Uh, all right, so what she is gonna have to do, or this other character's gonna have to do, is call it the Akula again. So we're gonna call that out again. And, uh, I said I'm not gonna sit here and wait you guys wait. I'll uh when I get 
get back here and get it set up and ready to go. We'll, we'll pick back up with that. All right, guys. So yeah, uh, the cooler was definitely a no go. We had problems with the uh, the rotors getting destroyed and whatnot. I'm trying to block off both sides over here. So helicopters, uh, yeah, may or may not be a thing. I don't know because obviously you can only call so many vehicles. So I was just using the MLC cab to try to uh, block off one side, and it was just it was a bit getting it in here and all that. So for this this whole area was a bad idea. So, okay, we got set up. I'm ready, so I'm ready in a position to get the car right now. Uh, I got the, the rise you over here. Um, I got both sides blocked off. I say, I'm pretty much we're gonna have to tie this perfectly. Uh, that character's got to teleport out first, and I'm gonna have to teleport in. Uh, I got my MLC set to no one, so I won't accidentally get inside that. And the thing that sucks, guys, if you fail in a certain way, uh, you gotta start out pretty much all over again. <laughs> this is a lot of setup, so yeah. But all right, here goes nothing. She's got to teleport out. Well, I'm teleporting in. Here we go. Got it. Look at that. And it's it's got to be just like that, guys. It's literally got to be like no room for error. I'm outside the MLC here. I'm all screwed up here, but uh, it's literally got to be like that. No room for error. I finally got it. It's a hell of a lot of rigmarole, though, guys. I mean, if you really want these jets and whatnot, not that bad. Uh, I guess you know go ahead and go for it if you're just doing regular vehicles I would say stick to just regular gift card of friends and things like that uh, You know just regular weaponized vehicles or whatever obviously if you want special vehicles like nightclub vehicles or uh, uh, Facility vehicles things like that you're gonna have to do it this way uh, Or planes or whatever, but just blocking off both sides is a real pain in the butt but as you've seen I can uh, You know you could just use the givers uh, MLC cab and and trailer in tandem there to get that uh, Or if there's more people around you know, they can use their MLC cabs or whatever The helicopters are gonna be a little bit tricky because you got the you know, like I said the rotors you got to worry about uh, But yeah, I'm gonna get an invite because obviously I can't just leave out my stuff my MLC right now because I'm in the black void so we're gonna get an invite from that console and uh, Yeah, that's how you do it guys, and then you can just you know like me, what I like to do, I just job teleport up to, because Mammoth is gone anyway, it doesn't matter. You guys start from square one again anyway to get another vehicle. So I'll just job teleport up to my uh, hangar and then just call it the, you know, my MLC vehicle, fly it in there, override a buzzard or whatever vehicle. Always make sure your, your hangar is full, guys. Otherwise, you can get dead spots because uh, you know, you're deleting an LG, for, which is a regular vehicle, obviously, for an aircraft. That can definitely cause problems, so be careful with that. Always make sure your hangar is full. And don't use streetcars and things like that for this. I uh, use an already owned vehicle because that's another way to get into the spot too. And a lot of guys won't tell you that, you know what I mean? So, but yeah, man, that's it. Uh, yeah, appreciate you guys stopping by, man. Uh, please smash, drop, kick in the face that like button because it literally took me like an hour and a half or more to set all this up and all the fail attempts and everything else. So, all right, guys, appreciate you. Thank you for uh, tuning in, and we will catch you next time. Peace.